All right. We've made it to White Run. No lightning. I walked up to these two horses. N that's clearly not mine. That's uh, I don't know who you are, but you're not mine. And then this one, apparently I can purchase from him, but I own a horse. <sighs> we're going to find lightning if it's the last thing that I do. All right. So we need to head to Solitude, which is where we're going to head next and then find lightning after we get that guild stuff set up. Because if we don't, I'm going to forget because supposedly I'm a guild leader. All right, it is pitch black out, which is awkward for arriving, but that's fine. Maybe it makes more of a spooky entrance. Also, while we were on the carriage ride, we got something about a horse whisperer where they've been gotten taming wild horses and to keep up with the demand and something about a hustler. We should speak to somebody that knows things about horses. Now on my map, apparently I've got to go to the, someplace near Windhelm. I'm guessing that's the Windhelm stable, right? But Here's my theory. Here's my theory. Those aren't actually wild horses. No, my theory is that lightning is there. My theory is that, well, I just, lightning must have run off. I mean, lightning is lightning's own person. I can't tell that horse what to do. So my theory is that lightning is there. He's one of the horses on the map. If you've come to Solitude to join the I... Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, just keep your nose clean while you're here. Or you'll end up like Rogvir. I don't know who Rogvir is, and uh, my nose is always clean, sir. I bathe. I don't know if I can say the same about you, though. You're hiding behind that helmet. Anyways, so I think Lightning got mixed up with these wild horses. Business. I wouldn't be surprised if he's just off and somebody cataloged him as a wild horse. So we're going to have to go find Lightning. We're going to have to go after this to Windhelm and buy a map. I'm going to have to buy a map to get my own horse back. That's... I don't know how I feel about that. No, I really don't. Positions. Okay. Well, we walked into go solitude to this. So this this is how today is starting. <laughs> Ending, because it's nighttime. I'm going to keep going. I'm not, I don't know what. Oh, wow. You all are awfully chatty for this time of night. It's late. Shouldn't you all be in bed? You helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape. Okay, something about Ulfric Stormcloak. I don't know what is going on. Apparently, we were out on that dig site for what feels like years. So that's fine. We're just going to keep going. We're just going to ignore everybody. All right. So, to-do list. After this, after we talk to the, uh, the guy at the museum. Right, the museum. After that, we're going to go find lightning. Well, first we got to go to Windhelm. Then we're going to go find lightning. And then after that... After that, I am owed so many cups of tea. That's it. I'm owed so many cups of tea. All right. But here's the thing. Let's not, let's not jog up the stairs just in case he's watching. We don't want to look like, you know, those kinds of people. Just nice, steady pace. Up we go. Right? Good. So now we look like a normal person. Right? Excellent. Avery. Good. Good. Okay. Remember, tough, firm guild master but also kind and caring you care about your digs and and the artifacts yes we do care about the artifacts all right i'm gonna turn off my lamp because we don't need that accessory all right in we go oh this is lovely oh this is lovely okay this is really lovely they want us to work with them okay there he is don't trip avery you trip on this rug they're not going to want to work with you and it's a very nice rug don't trip on it all right Slow and steady. Slow and steady. Ah, good day to you, Guildmaster. Hello. I trust you are faring well. I am. How goes the excavation? Uh, it's a little accident set us back. I just, we're fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that. I trust nobody was seriously hurt. Just a few bumps and bruises. I, statue dream. It Bumps and bruises. Bumps and bruises. That's good to hear. Did Carl inform you I wanted to speak with you? Yes, he said you had a proposal or something. I, I gotta be honest. Uh, yes, no, sorry. Yes. Well, it's a bit of a proposal and a request. We've been cordial neighbors for some time now. The explorers and the museum, that is. We have. And I began to think that it is rather silly that we aren't working more closely with one another. Then Carl told me of the availability of the chief librarian position in your guild, and I thought that I might offer my expertise in that role. 
In exchange, I was hoping that you and your explorers might be willing to undertake some exploration and excavation of a variety of artifacts. Funded by the museum, of course. I have just completed the majority of the renovations to the building and would be ready to open officially if I could find some reliable treasure hunters or mercenaries. I think that you and your people would be eminently qualified. So I was thinking that I become chief librarian for the Explorer Society and you become the relic hunter for the museum. Ooh. Oh, yeah. So, yes. First of all, yes. But to clarify, are you going to buy any and all artifacts we find? Like, like I mean, any. Like, I mean, the last dig site we were at, there looked like there was a really old bread. Do you want that too? Or am I not going to be able to sell you that? I don't... Nobody buys really old Akaviri bread, so... Well, I was thinking more that I would simply safeguard and showcase the things you found, offer you funding and occasional finder's fees, and that way you can access any of the collection you provide at your discretion. Oh. Oh, okay. I like that even better. All right, so that, that sounds like a really good arrangement. Excellent. Well, let me give you the ten septum tour. Then. Let's. I'm likely to have a variety of tasks for you, but in between, I'm sure you could help me find a random relic or two. Oh, of I've course, been of course, of course. Feel free to look around and come find me if you have any questions. I'm very excited about the prospects of where we are headed. Same. Oh, same. Almost forgot. Oh. There is a safe house upstairs with all the amenities you could ever want. I don't utilize it much, so you can feel free to. Lodging. And lastly, I have a, a few house. leads for you to get started. First is an artifact I heard is for sale by a general merchant in Helgen named Borgoth. Okay. He said he would hold the item for me for a while. So off to Helgen. He said he would hold the item for me for a while. So it may be best to retrieve it first. The others, well, the notes will tell you all you need to know about them. Okay. We're going to do some reading then. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Very much. Okay. So, oh, wait, wait, come back. You're walking away. You're walking away and I'm trying to walk at a normal pace. Don't make me jog. Don't. No, you're still walking. Don't make me jog. I got the relic. We got. We picked up the thing at the dig site and I had to kill a dead dude. Oh, I thought that sounded redundant. He was already dead. Yes, but he came back to life as a ghost and I had to kill him because he was a ghost trying to kill me. I know a murdering ghost. <laughs> what we relic hunters get up to. Get back here. All right, listen, I'm going to you're going to force me. To, all right, we're jogging. We're jogging. You forced me to jog, sir. What can I do for you? Um, um, okay, listen, we, can you tell me about this piece? I don't, I don't actually need a lot of details, but will you take it from me? Oh, that is quite a lovely piece, isn't it? Right? I believe it's called Drakensang. Legend tells that the weapon was forged from a talon of the tiger dragon of Karpo Toon. The leader of the cat folk of Akavir, Toshraka, who allegedly metamorphosized himself into a dragon. Oh, not entirely sure if there is any truth to it or if it's just mythology, but the weapon is a beautiful piece nonetheless. Oh, I mean, it was very pretty. You could display it on the dagger racks in the main hall if you'd like. And here's a finder's fee to help you fund your next expedition. Thank you. Fantastic. Okay, so... Um, okay. Where's the dagger rack? Where... If I was a dagger rack, could, could I have... You don't want to give me the full... No, okay, he doesn't want to give me the exact location of this dagger rack. All right, this is far too large to all be for daggers. All right, maybe we should go up the stairs. Let's go up the stairs. All right, so we now have lodging? Lodging. I didn't think that that was going to happen, but apparently we now have lodging. Oh, that's so much nicer. All right. This is... That's a very nice door thing. Oh, oh, that's a circle. And the relic I picked up was a circle. Maybe they go to get. Okay, well, I think I saw the word. Okay, that's the dagger. This must be dagger stuff. Oh, there. Yes. Oh, that looks very pretty. Oh, okay. All right. Let's let's go check out this lodging that uh, we supposedly get while we're here. I, for one, am very, very curious to see what, uh, what uh, kind of apartment. I mean, he said a safe house. Are we talking, like, plush and delightful? Or are we talking, like, I'm gonna want to sleep in this, the barracks at the guild the quarter again? If I could avoid sleeping in that area with everybody else at the same time kind of thing. 
That'd be lovely. Hello. Hi. Yeah, I'm just gonna, gonna keep going. Where did he say the safe house was? Upstairs? I don't know. I don't know where to go. Okay, so this is this is where he mentioned everybody else sleeps, I think, right? That's a that's a bed. Okay. That's not the safe house. This is not I don't feel like this is a safe house. Okay. What's what's in here? He he walked through here and I was chasing him and talking about ghosts, so that's off limits. Okay. Oh. Okay, hello. This is a nice big area. Oh, that's some very pretty lighting. Okay. Oh, prep station. Shall I place the display items from my inventory? Oh, this is what he was talking about. This is the lazy route. Oh. Oh, that's the route for me. Yeah, no, no, no. We're definitely gonna come back to that. Uh, what else do we have? Um, nice curtains. Those curtains are lovely miscellaneous oh it's a clutter chest i've got a lot of clutter hazards of being a relic hunter replica workbench oh is this is this so if i don't like you want to display some of this stuff is this that way i don't have to get rid of it i can like sell it for full price and then then use the replica oh that's okay yeah that's nice all right what else do we got going here I don't want to take his coin purse. That's rude. That's rude. Avery. Avery. We don't take other people's money. That's a sword case. A very elegant and beautiful sword lies displayed nicely behind glass, but curiously is tucked away in the curator's office rather than on display. Maybe I should ask him about it. Maybe I should. Okay. But there's no, there's no clear cut door here. This is, oh, the light. Oh, there's even a plaque above the door. It's like an official museum. All right. What is in here? We're just, oh, oh, well, this is lovely. Wow. Wow. Oh, they even put stained glass on the ceiling. That's dedication to the cause. I hope we never get a really bad rainstorm. Do you think that that's enchanted? So if there's hail, we're not all going to die because the glass will fall through and then just, all right. Note to self, the next time it's raining, don't be in here. Don't be in here the next time there's hail. Um, oh, okay. That looks like a contraption I don't really want to touch. A printing, <gasps> a printing press and a paper store. Do we have a store? Do we sell this to the rest of solitude? Use the printing press. Okay. Um, apparently I can just make more rolls of paper. I don't, I don't need any more paper. I'm oh, good. Thank you. So the saber cat. We'll come back to that. All right. Okay, this looks like more spots for probably some of the more dangerous things. Did you hear him? Yeah, he definitely, definitely mentioned Daedra earlier, didn't he? Is he going to expect me to go relic hunting and Daedric artifacts? I think he is. I, uh, I definitely think he is. Okay, so that, that's definitely not at all what I was hoping for when we started on this venture. This library is gorgeous. We're gonna have to come back here. Definitely gonna have to come back here. Definitely gonna have to come back. Oh, oh, there's a desk there. I'm guessing that's his. Oh, well, isn't this a nice little sitting area? Bless you. Uh, my, it's starting to get a bit dusty in here. Oh, yeah, I, it books. What are you gonna do about it? Bless you though. All right, what's up here? There's another door. There's a lot of doors. Is that normal for a museum? I really, I normally just sell the relics and I don't really see wherever they're displayed. All right, what is this? Dragonborn Hall. Oh, didn't he mention something about my accomplishments? My accomplish. Oh. Oh, oh, my sweet roll. We're gonna have to accomplish a lot of things. Yeah, I'm so gonna have to... Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. There is a lot to fill in here. All right, so... How many accomplishments am I gonna have to have to fill up this, this, this hall? This is a little intimidating. Okay, listen. You know what? Before we get over... We're just gonna leave. We're gonna leave. We're gonna come back here at a different point. We'll go through it quietly and quickly later on when it, that doesn't seem entirely overwhelming. 
Maybe never. Maybe never. Maybe that's the hall we just ignore. Oh, there's an... Oh, wait, no. We're on the second floor, right? Do we walk upstairs? Is there a second, third floor? That's an, a locked door. It requires a key. I don't have keys. <gasps> now that I'm the guild hunter for this place, does that mean I get a key? I think I should get a key to the museum. Also the safe. Uh, not the safe. Not that I'm not trust... I'm very trustworthy. I think. Oh, what is this? The Hall of Natural Science. Okay. Natural science as opposed to unnatural science. Is there an unnatural science exhibit? Oh, this is one of these places. Am I going to have to build stuffed stuff kind of thing? And like, you know, I, I, I what is that? A taxidermy? I don't do taxidermy. Like, can I give you the stuff and then you can taxidermy? He's not here. I'm talking to myself right now. He is not here. But I think that that's what's going to happen. We're going to, we're going to just come back to this at a different build. What? Did that just say dragon? Did that, that didn't just say dragon. Elder dragon? Dragons don't exist. I mean, they used to, but they don't exist anymore. Right? They're gone. They went bye-byes. No, they're no dragons. Fine. Avery, it's fine. It's so fine. Okay, that looks quaint and cute. That looks like oh looks like dig site stuff. Alright, so you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We're just gonna have to collect a whole bunch of taxidermy-ish stuff. Learn how to taxidermy, unless no, I really think though that there's gonna be somebody else in the museum that must know. I must just bring the supplies and then they make it happen. That would, that would make the most sense. Let's not, let's not worry about this. I don't know what's up these stairs though, but I see a set of stairs and I'm going to walk up them. Makes me, makes me curious to know what's up top, right? That's the, uh, that's, that's the relic hunter in me, right? We're going to go with that. So we got an apartment. We got to go find that. <gasps> oh, what is this? Is this a spot for <gasps> fossils? Oh, so many fo- oh, we can- oh, it's primitive squirrel fossil, ancient bird fossil. Oh, I'm so excited. I am so excited. Ancient cliff racer, primitive deer. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. Okay, well, now I know where I'm going to spend most of my time in this museum because taxidermy, like I said, not my thing, but fossils, I'll dig for fossils all day long. Yes, I know. I'm allergic to camping. Digging for fossils, I'm not quite as allergic to. It's backwards, I know, but fossils are cool. Camping is also cool in that it's not for me. That's, that's what we're going to go with. Camping is cool, but it's just not my thing. Okay, so now we just need to find our apartment. Oh. Okay. Well, this definitely fits more than a single bed. Is this really mine? Did he, did he really say I get to live here for free? This is part of being the official relic hunter for this place? Yes. A hundred percent. Yes. Oh, and I can turn that. <gasps> oh, we have chandeliers. Okay. All right. Where are we going to start? There's a left door and a right door. Oh, well, this is, this, this is a statement. You walk in here and you know, this person has good taste. Which clearly I do, but like, now my place references that. All right, let's go to the right door first because I can. Let's see, what do we have available to us? In here. <gasps> Crafting with mannequins everywhere. Oh, I guess. All right, well, listen, we'll, we'll worry about that later. We'll just ignore them for now. There is all sorts of stuff in here, though. All these crafting benches. <gasps> Oh, we can do a lot in here. Not that I'm not talented at crafting, but like I've always wanted to get better at it. There's no time like the present, right? So what? We've got a whole boatload of things to do and a horse to find, but that's fine. We can still learn how to be a blacksmith in the comfort of our own home. I mean, I could do it in my sweatpants, you know? I could, I could just hang out in my comfy clothes and learn how to blacksmith. I, I think that's great. Don't have to pay for glasses now. What is that? Pull chain. This seems like a terrible idea after the whole dead king thing ghost, but you know what? 
Oh, okay. It's a, it's a smelter. Oh, it's a smelter. Oh, how cool. Can we just leave that on because it, it's pretty? We're leaving it on because it's pretty. Did that mannequin move? They're not moving, are they? Are they alive? Oh, boy. Okay, arcane enchanter. Oh, this is lovely. He did such a good job decorating. I wonder who decorated. Do you think it was the museum curator, dude? Or do you think it was somebody else? Alchemy, ingredients. Oh, look at all this good stuff. Look at all this good stuff. A staff thingy? Oh, a staff enchanter. You can enchant a staff. All right, well, that would make sense. The mage is always running around with them, their staffs and stuff like that. I wouldn't know. I've got a little bit of magic that I can do, but I don't really tell people about it. It's very, very, very small, the amount of magic that I can actually do. But I mean, it's there. Should I ever need it? Replica. Oh, another replica workbench. Excellent. Excellent. So I don't have to go downstairs. Once again, can do stuff in the comfort of my own home. Uh, an archaeology workstation. Oh, this is for me. Oh, oh, I can re... Oh, good. Okay. So when we find stuff out in the world i have a place to come back and try to piece it together once again in the comfort of my own home i'm so excited about that did i say did i mention this was mine now <laughs> i'm never giving it back even if we stop working together at the museum i'm never giving any of this back nope they're gonna have to kick me out of here all by themselves good luck all right what's in here oh oh well this is huge Okay, we could definitely throw a party, even though I'm not really social at all. That's fine. We could still throw a rockin' party. Or, or there's plenty of room to stack up all the junk that I pick up along the way. Let's just, well, let's just, let's just talk realistic here. It's just gonna work for all of the stuff that I have. Okay, we also have, oh, this kitchen. Okay, I, I might be horrible at a lot of things but cooking is one thing that i am not horrible at question question can i make tea does this does this let me make tea can i make tea at my you know so i don't have to like buy it anymore oh i can i gotta go get all the ingredients again because apparently i'm fresh out but <gasps> we can make tea now at home i don't have to go out and buy it anymore okay okay we we're gonna definitely get down to cooking and making more tea taking it on the road okay that's horrifying that there's a rabbit hanging can we get rid of that oh maybe we can get rid of that open the cool <gasps> we have a frid cooler thing it is kind of it it keeps stuff cold okay good so when i make tea if i want to make iced tea that works and we have a storage closet every kitchen needs a storage closet right what do you store in a kitchen storage closet okay we've got mead okay listen spiced wine i'm more apt to be a spiced wine kind of gal not a mead fan i mean really really i just want tea and water why is it in skyrim all you can ever find is mead or ale or wine or brandy or alcohol why is that all that the nords drink do they drink anything else i don't think so i don't think that the nords really that confuses me that's fine, though. All more tea for me. I don't have to share. All right, that room looks dangerous, so we're going to come back to that a different day. Let's go up the stairs. Maybe this is where the bed... I would assume that this is where my bedroom is. Oh, it's a cute little map. All right. This is, this is a nice set of stairs. I like this. I like these stairs. All right. You know what? This door first. <gasps> oh, is this for me? Oh, it's a skylight. Hopefully this glass is hailproof. Kind of like what we talked about downstairs. But, ooh, and look at this bed. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we're definitely moving in. And a spot for all of my jewelry. Oh, and just extra stuff and clothes. All of my clothes can go here. And an organized dresser so I can put my various outfits. Oh, God. Oh, this is just... Oh, I cannot tell you how much I love this. And then what is this? Closet? <gasps> big bathtub oh well we're never leaving we're never ever 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 leaving i gotta go out and relic hunt at some point but like do i have to i'm gonna close that door okay so what do we think is all right go this way 
That's a nice little bench and area to sit in. Okay. All right. This, I don't know what goes in here. Dance party? I don't dance. I don't know. We'll find out though. It's a lot of space, whatever it is. I mean, maybe I could get dogs. <gasps> I mean, you could get dogs and give them each their own space there. And you could also put big relics there. You know, is that a dragon skull? Where did they find a dragon skull? Like I said, aren't they extinct thing? Don't they not ex- I mean, true, we are archaeologists. That would make sense, but that looks foreboding. Okay. Over here. Another big room. I don't know what this is for either. More dance parties. This is more likely dance parties. Huh. Can I make my own library? I could use the other room for a library. This room could house like a gazillion cute animals. Bunnies. Maybe some dogs. I think I like this idea. All right. So I have two empty rooms. Maybe that's why he decided not to move in because there were two empty rooms. Maybe. All right. That's fine. And then is that an outside? Do we have outside? What is out here? Oh. Oh, look at this. It's solitude. Okay. All right. So we have a gigantic wraparound porch. Oh, this is lovely. Okay. Got the... Okay. Oh, look at this view. Oh, this will be nice with tea in the morning. Mm-hmm. This will be excellent with a cup of tea. First thing in the morning. Down there. Oh, isn't the... Isn't the guild... Isn't, oh, am I right above the guild? Oh, that would make sense. And then more dance parties. Okay, so clearly, clearly what I've learned is that the safe house is A, gorgeous, and B, meant to have a lot of dance parties, even though A, I'm not social, and B, I don't dance, but that's fine. All right. All right. You know what? I'm going to go get comfy, and then we're going, to, I'm going to have to also figure out where everything goes. All right. So stuff put away. Changed into comfy clothes. We still have to explore the rest of the museum today. Possibly put the rest of my stuff away. My horse is still missing. Still. Still missing. We'll find lightning next. So, plans for the rest of the day. Put my stuff away that I have collected for the museum because I'm sure at the bottom of my backpack there has to be at least two or three things that can get stored here. Maybe even a few books, because, I mean, I pick them up, I collect them. Whenever I find a book, I just pick it up. Why would you leave a perfectly good book behind if nobody else is going to read it? You might read it, or you never know who else might read it, and then you have just a nice stack of books. Books are pretty. Anyways, going to go put the rest of the stuff away in the museum. We'll, we'll see how the lazy he's going to put it all the way for me goes. Then we're going to get a good night's sleep. Then we're going to find lightning. And then we're going to see all the different things that he told me he needs me to do. Easy, right? What could go wrong? This is great. We have a nice place. We're going to find my horse and then make some tea. Yeah, tea is up there. Uh, that might be before. No, Avery, find the horse first. Then we'll make tea. But it's going to be fine, right? <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? <laughs>